Welcome to the enchanting world of Eldergrove, where magic and mystery intertwine. In this chapter, we delve into the aftermath of the festival, where our young adventurers, Evelyn, Finn, and Lila, face the consequences of their choices. Join us as we explore the cobblestone streets, the eerie tailor's shop, and the secrets that lie within. Stay tuned as the story unfolds, revealing the threads of destiny that bind our heroes. Subscribe to Storyteller for more captivating tales. In the quaint town of Eldergrove, the festival's echoes have faded, leaving behind an uneasy silence. The cobblestone streets, once alive with laughter, now lie still, shrouded in mystery. Evelyn, with her wild, curly hair, stands at the threshold of the tailor's shop, a place filled with memories and secrets. As she pushes the door open, the familiar scent of aged fabric and wood smoke envelopes her. But today it feels different, thicker, almost suffocating. The flickering candlelight casts eerie shadows that dance along the walls, whispering secrets of the past. Evelyn, with a steady yet uncertain voice, declares the need to confront the tailor. She has taken on the mantle of leadership, a role that feels both exhilarating and burdensome. Finn lingers behind, his thoughtful blue eyes darting nervously around the shop. The chaos of the festival still echoes in his mind, a cacophony of emotions that threaten to overwhelm him. Finn has always been the cautious one, the voice of reason, but now he feels the stirrings of something deeper within, a desire to reclaim his own voice. As he hesitates, the words caught in his throat, Lila steps forward. With her fiery red hair and mischievous grin, she boldly declares their need to confront the tailor about the costumes and the magic. Her words ignite a spark of courage in Finn, and he nods, feeling the warmth of camaraderie envelop him. As they venture deeper into the shop, the atmosphere thickens with tension. The mysterious tailor emerges from the shadows, his patchwork coat shimmering with an otherworldly glow. His eyes, ancient and knowing, seem to pierce through the veil of their innocence. Ah, my young adventurers, he greets, his voice smooth yet laced with an unsettling undertone. You've come seeking answers, have you? Evelyn steps forward, her heart racing. We want to know the truth about the costumes and the magic. What have you done to us? The words hang in the air, heavy with accusation and fear.